Away from that, the smooth delivery in service in the counties now hangs in the balance following a countywide ghost law by members of the county assembly. A majority of the 47 county assemblies have indefinitely adjourned their settings in protest over pay cuts by the Salaries and Remuneration Commission. That decision to withdraw the allowances and call for autonomy in the management of ward funds. Now, this is likely to be felt immediately as the county assemblies have adjourned before passing the county budgets for the next financial year. Legally, the county assemblies are required to pass the budgets before the end of the current financial year, which, by the way, lapses at the end of this month. Now, today, the ward representatives, through their Secretary General, Stanley Karanja, have petitioned the Office of the Deputy President, the Speaker's of the National Assembly and the Senate to intervene. Ken Geshuhi reports. Wasingishu County Assembly joined tens of other county assemblies that have indefinitely adjourned their sittings. This comes just a week after the Salaries and Remuneration Commission, SRC, announced a pay rise of 10,000 shillings for MCS, a move that has not sat well with them. It's not worth uh, the wait for almost eight to ten years that they have been waiting for the increment of, uh, uh, of the salary. The members of county assembly and the body that is county assembly forum decided it's now time for the county assembly to shut down then to have engagement with the SRC. Ure Mshahala Mbao Turiambio MCS were younger than 10,000 shillings. That is an annual increment and in Madarao kwa SRC kuja kusema ya kwamba wa shimua miongezo mshahara. According to the ward reps, changes affected by the SRC are an affront to devolution. Lazima tuchunge mambo ya devolution. Na devolution inaanza na sisi, MCAs hapa chini. Lazima tukue empowered vizuri. Na si kwa sababu MCAs ambao wako saizi. We must protect iyo ofisi ya MCAs. Ata wale ambao watakuja miaka ambazo zinakuja. So that devolution ya inchi yetu ya Kenya isipote hapa katikati. Sisi kama MC yetu na shindo kutekeleza majukumu yetu kwa sababu ya tujapatua uwezo ambao tunastahili na ili tuweze kufanya kazi vile ambavyo katiba inasema. With business in the county assemblies grinding to a halt, service delivery to Kenyans has been placed on the line. County budgets are yet to be approved with less than 10 days to the constitutional deadline of June 30th. Yes, we had uh, expected uh, the CEC member to uh, give us the uh, policy statement yesterday, but now the members of county assembly decided otherwise and said unless SRC come to the table and we decide and, uh, and talk, then now we can continue with the work uh, of the county assembly. Kwanzia leo, Tuesday jana na leo, buge zote zifuge. Hakuna budget itapita, hakuna kupitisha budget. Wacha kama kimeumana, wacha kirabane. Yule bottom, haumie. Na yule yuko top, haumie. The ward reps through their national secretary, Stanley Karanja, have petitioned senior offices in the national government for intervention. SRC kama vile ambavo uh, wengi mnajua, tumekua tukiongea na wao, kupitia kwa chama chetu cha CAF, na atuja kuwa na uh, muelekeo mzuri. Na petition ya kwanza ambao national secretary atasema ni kwamba itaenda kwa SRC, Tukiwambia sisi ya tuja furairi ya jambo. Yungi itaenda kwa devolution ambayo inaongozo na deputy president. Kuna yungi itaenda senate national assembly na kafu ya nyewe ambayo natusumamia. We want a formula ambayo inaonyesha ya kwamba MCA na governor pesa zenu inaenda hivi na ya, ya governor kama ni mia ya MCA itakuwa 49%. Apart from their remuneration, the ward reps are seeking autonomy in the management of ward funds. Ken Gashohe, KTN News. Now let's take you a little bit out of town, but uh, for an event that happened right here in the